All right, y'all, let's talk about it. Looks like another Christian rapper has denounced his faith. And this is an old school rapper. He's uh goes by the name Fanatic. And uh, many of you know him from the Cross Movement. And uh, he's, he's one of the pioneers of Christian hip-hop. And what's sad is that after so many years... He just all of a sudden had this revelation and this process of which he just stopped believing and uh, lost his faith. And uh, you know what? If we put people in a pedestal and we start worshiping these these uh, rappers and entertainers, then we would be like, oh, I'm going to lose my faith, too. I'm going to follow you. And uh, yeah, no, 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 no. See, my faith continues to be founded on the word of God and what what Jesus and the Bible and God says and so just because Mr. Fanatic uh, all of a sudden had this uh, epiphany that you know he can't believe it anymore because uh, after his own study of the scripture uh, he, he just doesn't believe it and you know what the way I look at it is that maybe you never really understood the word of God or had never really fully been saved. That's not judging. That's just what the Bible says. And when I think about all these so-called entertainers, rappers, uh, Christians saying that, oh, I'm denouncing my faith. I, I don't believe it because you know what? Oh, uh, this is this is not what this is. This is all just this is all just fake or I just don't I, I don't believe it anymore. Then you know what? That's fine because you get to choose that. But I fear for you in a sense that you're going to come before God and you're going to try to explain yourself. All right. Explain that to God. OK. And um, I may sound harsh right now, but you know what? We got to pray for this brother. We got to pray for him that he comes to a true realization of who God is, because if you start renouncing your faith, you're not. You're not um, hurting anybody's feelings. The truth is that you're rejecting God, and you should know that. And the verse that comes to my mind is 1 Timothy 4, verse 1. Now, the Spirit speaketh expressly that in the latter times some shall depart from the faith, giving heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of devil. Now, I don't know, but it sounds like you just got fully woke, so woke that you fell asleep because you are being lulled to sleep by the devil following all this stuff. And so I pray that you get right with the Lord and I pray that before he dies, he gets right with God because trust me, you're going to meet God one day and you don't want to be saying all this stuff that you're saying right now.